We'll guide you through how to back up your iPhone to your PC. If you find this useful, then please consider subscribing and liking the video. First of all, come onto your PC. So it's a good idea to frequently back up your iPhone to keep your photo safe and everything else on your iPhone. And you can also go and restore to it in the future. So to go and do this, we do need to go and get an app on our computer. And that app is called iTunes. So all you need to do is go and open up the Microsoft Store. You can then head to the top and go and type in iTunes, just like so. It's this app here, go and click on it. Where mine says open, you also go and say get, and you can get it. After you've got it and it's installed and everything's ready, go and click on open and it will open up. And now what you need to do is go and connect your iPhone to your computer. You can do that using the cable it came with. Depending upon what ports your computer has, you may need to use an adapter. Plug one end of the cable into your computer and then unlock your iPhone and plug the other end into your iPhone. You should then go and get a pop-up on your iPhone shortly. Saying trust this computer, you need to go and click on trust and you also go and get a pop-up on your computer saying you want to allow this computer to access information. So I'm gonna press continue and trust. And you also need to go and enter in your passcode on your iPhone as well. Now it should go and connect. And shortly in the top left of iTunes, you're going to go and see a phone icon appear. As you can see, it just did. And you can then go and click on it. It'll go and take a moment and you can start to see information about your iPhone here. Scroll down in summary to backups and you can choose the automatic backup option. But to go and back up to your computer now, all you need to do is go over to the right and go and click on backup. When you do that, it will say backing up and that's it. And you'll need to go and enter your passcode on your iPhone to trust this computer to go and start the backup. Then all you need to do is go and wait. And in the future, you can restore the backup by clicking there. If you found this useful, then leave a like.